Hello everybody, my name is Nihil and today I have a very quick uh, cash video for you for the CT side. If you play B, then this is for you. Because I see uh, a lot of people, uh, including me in the past, kind of just throwing nades like this, smoking it like this. And this is really bad. This smoke grenade here, for example, is just horrible. Because all it does is hurt you. Uh, the terrorists can now pass by without being seen and can actually get into vent room or checkers uh, without being seen and they can backstab the guy that plays vent for example uh, if you have a CT playing in there and they can pop out here pretty unexpectedly so this smoke grenade was horrible um, and then the more you do this I mean you might have some sort of point of alignment down here like there but ultimately it's really hard to get these smokes to be good um, if you're just freestyling like this so what I have for you is a simple, very simple way, maybe some of you already know that, I don't know, um, to get the smokes to be much better, much more consistent. So I'm just gonna wait for that smoke to clear and then I'll, I'll show you. One important aspect though is there's a lot of different ways to kind of line yourself up on the site here with this, with this and stuff. The problem is uh, this is not just about throwing the smoke grenade properly, it's also a lot about timing, because CTs don't have a lot of time on B, okay? When they go here, when you go, when you come in into this bomb site right here, you do not have time to spend a second or two to just line yourself up and do something complicated here. Uh, it's just like, like, I don't know, like, you know, lining up with, first of all, running against this, like, aiming here, running out, letting go, because when you do all that, the terrorists are actually going to be there before you are, okay? You are going to be out of position, and your smoke is not going to be up in time, because when terrorists rush, uh, full-on rush, they are here just slightly after you. So what we need is a smoke grenade that not just lands right, but it also pops soon enough so that we can actually make use of it and then we can also get into position to actually shoot anybody that pushes through. So the simple way to do it is to use W and D to slide, slide along this wall here, um, just like this. Right, so you just kind of slide along, have your smoke out, have it, have the pin pulled, and just once you see this panel, just kind of just let go of W, so you're just walking forward, and look at the center. Look at this right here. That thing. It's very simple. Oh, I guess uh, my script is messed up here for my crosshair. Well, whatever. Um, I hope you can still see that. So, slide along the wall, see the center, and just, while holding W, just let go. Just like that. And it doesn't have to be perfect, but notice how this is just a fairly consistent, very nice, and very quick smoke. So nothing you can see here, there's nothing, uh, the smoke cover is perfect. On this side, they have to actually push over this crate to see into vent room to get your CT. Uh, when they come here, they're in a really awkward spot, they're really open, they will drop down here. So if you're playing from you know anywhere near there or even in a headshot box, you will likely catch uh, terrorists when they're uh, falling down and their aim is uh, gonna be uh, bad. They won't be able to control themselves very well. So again, just slide along the wall, center of the thing and let go towards the center and it will be a nice, nice smoke every time. Um, to quickly also give you a variant of this smoke uh, when you're upstairs, it's slightly different, but it's also a useful smoke. If you are the player that goes upstairs, um, again, there's cool, th there's a cool smoke or multiple cool smokes you can throw from going into this corner here, or from lining up with the cardboard. But I'm not a fan of that because again, this takes too much time. You're gonna be like uh, fiddling around here, and uh, I don't know like throwing a complicated smoke and all the while the terrorists are just gonna run and look at this like if i was a terrorist right there this smoke wouldn't have affected me i was able to run while the smoke grenade was bouncing and not smoking i was already sort of past it or like 75 percent past it so that takes too much time so i've uh, basically figured out a very simple smoke that's very quick all you need to do is go into this corner these things are an illusion they don't exist you can just go over them. So all you need to do is just have the pun pi the, la, 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 the pun pilled. Just just pun the pill on the Grok's grenade. No, just uh, pill pill. Wow. <laughs> so all you need to do is have your pin pulled on the smoke grenade. Go into this corner and just look at this here. Okay, that is the top left corner of the wooden plank. Look at that and let go. 
And it will, it will bounce here, it will bounce there. And then it lands, it doesn't land as deep, okay? So it's a different smoke, but it's kind of a nice smoke where you can just then play the corner. Like when you see feet down here, you'll see the uh, the uh, terrorists way before they see you. So if they do try to either push inside or they try to push checker or vent room, you will, you will always have the drop on them. You'll always have the advantage while that smoke is up and you can really easily get kills. Um, if you want to re-smoke, by the way, just as a quick bonus tip here, if you want to re-smoke, you're in headshot, for example, you can really just always use this, uh, this part of the door and kind of bounce things off that way. So for re-smoking purposes, that's pretty damn cool. And you can, you can basically freestyle it. I think I usually walk these like that. And they go fairly deep. Nice coverage. No problemo. So if you want to re-smoke, uh, you're already in position, you have all the time in the world to line up. But if you want to throw that first smoke, you're gonna have to be on time, you're gonna have to be not just precise, but also quick. So practice that a couple of times. Again, I think the best smoke is from down here by sliding and then hitting the center of that weird panel thing. Just beautiful every time, really fast and you will have the advantage. So that is a really quick smoke guide for CTs on B uh, cash. So hopefully that helped you. Um, again, just uh, make sure to actually uh, use those in your games for advantage uh, in, in the game. And uh, you do really screw yourself over if you just kind of get panic mode on and just kind of, oh no, I need to smoke, I need to smoke. And then something like that happens and you've just you have you just basically smoked yourself you've thrown the smoke that the uh, t's can actually use to their advantage and that sucks all right so thank you for watching hopefully this helps uh you improve your ct side on cash if you're the b player thank you very much for watching my name has been nihil and bye bye